Fire up. Oh, okay. So it's a teleporter. Hello, everybody. Welcome to a game that is simply called No One Is Here. Because no one is here. You get it? I mean, that that's pretty much the whole joke we're going with here. Also, this game is a little loud. I'm going to lower it a bit on my side and then maybe raise it up a bit on your side. That way you can hear it a little better and I can hear it a little not so deafeningly. All right, that's good. Oh, okay, got it. Wait, now it's overpowering me. This music is a little off the rails, ain't it? Yeah, it's still overpowering me. Let's, let's take it down a notch, huh? Okay, that'll be good. Ooh, look at that. I'm just jumping all over the place, aren't I? What's in here? It's a very surreal looking environment, I must say. I love the, the art style, it looks really good. I love the intentional color banding, that, that looks really artistic. I see this is some kind of dark forest. I probably shouldn't stay in it too long. Something will probably kill me. Although I doubt that. But you know, you never know, right? Oh, I see. What the? Is that blood? Is that seriously supposed to be blood or am I just seeing things? I have to constantly adjust the volume here because it, it can't seem to decide if it wants to be soft or loud. What the? He's supposed to get up there. Are you even supposed to get up there? Nope. That's just to draw your attention towards the the sun in the sky that was always there. Right? That's it, right? What the heck? What is this? What is any of this? Ah, okay. I'm supposed to go up this? Nope, I can't go up this. It'd be nice if I could go somewhere. Okay, that kind of worked. But I get the feeling that's not where the game exactly wants me to go. Damn it. Come on. Okay, didn't exactly work that time, Dad did it. Maybe I should just go elsewhere. Probably to that blue area right over there. That might be good. What's over here, huh? What the? I'm afraid to find out what happens if I jump. I guess it's not like anything worse can happen, right? It's very beautiful music though, I will give it that. I'm in total isolation. What the? Is that where I started? A bunch of bloody chairs. I'm not even using British slang, that's literally it. They're bloody chairs. Ah, that's where I started. And you would think that given the... Given the obvious balance of this scene, you can tell that that is the dominant element in this scene. That is clearly where the game would seem to want me to go. But your guess is as good as mine if that's actually the case. Unless I'm mistaken, the only buttons I saw were basically to look, to move, to jump, and to run. So it's not like there's some kind of interact button that I'm not aware of. Damn it. Almost. Almost had it. But almost isn't going to cut it, is it? Dang it. One more time. One more time for real. One more time that I can actually get myself to jump because sometimes the g games don't want let you jump. Okay, you know what? Forget that. Well, since I have no idea where else to go, I think I'm just gonna jump off the edge and see what happens. Let's see what happens if I, if I jump off the blue ledge. 
I took the blue pill. Wee! Oh. Oh, okay. You just end up back here again. Oh, what do we have here? I didn't even notice this before. You can actually go inside this place. That's cool. That's very cool. I have to admit. What's in here? That is the burning question. The blue again? What the? What in the world? Huh? That's weird. Oh, okay, I get it. I think that's the point of the puzzle. You're supposed to fall off somewhere and then you go somewhere else. I'm going to assume that once I fall, I might just get somewhere where I need to, or I'll just get back, get sent back here. Is the whole purpose of this just to look around, or is there something that can actually happen? Because so far, not a lot has happened. Actually, nothing has happened. Just a lot of looking around. And don't get me wrong, that's cool. It, it's cool to just look around and appreciate the little world that's being built up here. I just... Kind of wish there was something that would happen. I'm sure there's something. I just haven't seen it yet. That's a distinct possibility. I cannot deny the possibilities. Okay. What's that? Dang. What the? Wait a minute. Oh, okay. That's just lights. For some reason, I saw the most bright part, the brightest part of that, and I thought maybe it's some kind of glowing sphere or something. Nope. It's literally just light. Nothing else. Sometimes a light is just a light, and it's nothing else. And with that, I am going to see if I can get anything else to happen. Hang tight real quick. the heck is this? What the? Is that a person? Some kind of blue crystal that's glowing and a humanoid thing on the ground? Was that person stabbed with that object or does that object have nothing to do with it? Was that person poisoned or maybe the, the crystal was some kind of artifact that overwhelmed him or sucked out his soul or did something else that I can't quite figure out? I can't make heads or tails of this. Oh well, hang tight again. You know, I never did bother to check and see what would happen if you go back and turn around on the very bridge you came in from. Maybe I should've. Whoa, what the hell is that? Is it possible? Nope. It's not possible. You're not going anywhere. If you thought you were escaping from this hell so easily, you've got another thing coming. And clearly this must be a hell. Because it's trying to keep me here. It doesn't want me to leave. Ever. It doesn't want you to ever leave. It wants you to be consumed by the madness. In fact, there's a maddening tune that plays when you try to leave. It just can't be done. That's the game's way of subtly telling you that if you try to leave, we will trap you. We will give you back. We will send you back. There's no escaping from this place. Now come, we have much to show you. This is what will happen to you if you keep trying to escape. <laughs> also, I did learn that it is possible to go up that fence. You just can't do anything else with it. In fact, I'll prove it. You can actually get up the first rung just by jumping to it. Watch this. Yeah, see? Now I just have to do it in a more stable fashion. Come on. There we go. Okay, so it is possible, but I checked. You can't jump into that from here. If I could just get up to the next rung, that'd be perfect. But I can't. Besides, that one has three. You can barely get to the second one, let alone the third one. 
unless it was actually possible to get to it from the chair, but it doesn't seem possible to get to it from the chair, so we may as well just rule that possibility out right now. And I'm going to take one final look around. Hang tight real quick. Huh, what do we have here? We have what could be content. Okay, what happens if I go to the one on the right, huh? There's got to be a correct answer here, right? Surely. It was probably the middle one, wasn't it? Well, I mean, there's no hurt, there's no harm in trying again, right? Right. I will eventually figure this out. Okay, it's not over here, it's to the left of this. Wait, no it's not. Where the heck is it? I know I saw three of them. In fact, I have proof. Video footage. You all saw it. You all saw that there were three of them at one point. Now I just have to retrace my steps. Right, I believe it was that way. I know I went somewhere in the, the thick of this and then all of a sudden, yeah, there was a, there was that. Okay, let's try the middle one. Is it you? Or am I being led astray again? Because if it's not that one, it has to be the left one. Or maybe you have to go through all of them and then something will happen. Because I'm pretty sure that's the only one I haven't gone through yet. Yep, that makes the most sense, doesn't it? Okay, I gotta keep hugging the trees. Or the red stuff. I'm gonna call it trees just for the sake of sanity. Just gotta keep hugging the trees until you figure it out. There we go. Okay, I'm pretty sure that's the last blue fall that I haven't triggered yet. So maybe something will happen. Who knows? That'd be nice, but somehow I get the feeling it's not going to be that fortunate. Because it seems like nothing's happening. No matter what I do, you just can't. You can't change fate. Or whatever you choose to call this. Maybe you gotta do it in order, who knows. Because I do know the, the leftmost one is right here. Or at least I'm pretty sure this is the one. Yeah, probably. This will probably be the most secret one. Oh wait, what? This is something different. What's in here? There are more dead bodies. Or at least what I assume are dead bodies. This is getting freaky. There are more of those crystals. What's it trying to tell me? Oh boy. This one's moving. This isn't just a walking tech demo. Something's happening to these people. Or at least that one. What are you trying to tell me? Are you trying to warn me or are you trying to kill me? Because, I mean, if you were trying to kill me, you probably would have killed me by now. So I'm going to guess you're trying to warn me about something. Did I win? What did I win? Do I win my freedom? Can I get, can I leave? May I leave? I know I actually know. I can't even say de definitively that I can leave, I'm asked. So, uh, it is legitimately a question, can I? Maybe something changed. Nope, of course not. You still can't leave. You still can't leave the way you came, anyway. Welp. Not even gonna try to jump, character, I guess. I guess that's the way the cookie crumbles, huh? Okay, what happens if I go down there now? Does anything change? Is there any... Is there any mysteries... Are there any mysteries that can be solved by going down here? Oh, okay. It's not that I triggered something else, it's that I went the d a different way. Ah, I get it now. So maybe it is just a, a tech demo of sorts. But it does show potential. I'll give it that. 
What are you trying to do? Here. Let me help you out. Oh, you can actually jump on top of him. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> wow, this is silly. You know, you're significantly less threatening when I can jump on top of your head and keep bouncing on top of you. Just saying, buddy. Well, I guess it's time for me to take my leave now. It doesn't appear as though anything in this game world is actually going to change. Although there is something up there. I don't know if I can get up there, though. That is a mystery to us all. It's a mystery to us all! Maybe I can. I mean, who knows? Maybe if I just keep hanging to the right, I can. It's worth a shot, at least. It would probably take me out that way. Come on. Okay. So you can't. You have no control over yourself when you're falling, so... Yeah, it's impossible. At least that way. It's impossible through that means. But maybe there's another way to get up there. Huh. Interesting. Very interesting. I want to try something. This gives me an idea. Since that is clearly over here, or at least this is the way to get over there to that specific part, maybe there is a way to get up there. And I just haven't seen it yet. Okay. So, if, if I rip... Oh, okay. So it's a teleporter. Cool! It's another blue thing. I get the feeling it's not actually going to do much, though. Nope. Doesn't do a damn thing. But at least I've seen all of it. I've seen all there is to be seen, at least. I can tell myself that. It's, it's a very interesting environment. And the art style is obviously very, very good and simplistic. Which, for, for some reason, it's reminding me of Dr. Seuss. Just a darker tone. So I guess you can say the darker, more sinister version of Dr. Seuss. Who knows? Maybe that's... Crap, what's his name? Uh, Tim... Tim Burton? Maybe it's that kind of style? Nah. He's got a different style. He's not just darker Dr. Seuss. He has his own unique style. So, unfortunately, this is probably all out, all that there is to show. I don't see anything else. If I Trust me, if I did, I'd show you. But I think that is it for now. There does appear to be an interesting amount of content to this. That is it for now. Thank you so much for tuning in with me. Make sure to spread this video around like bodies at the bottom of this floating island. And I will see you next time. Now go out there and capitalize on life. Peace out, have a good one, and have a nice and pleasant day. If you enjoyed the content and want to stay up to date, I upload 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time every single day. You can also subscribe and hit the bell icon or just check out the end screens right here.